as part of the established performance supplement series, the article, titled Evidence-Based Supplements for the Enhancement of Athletic Performance by Peeling and Colleagues, provides information on sodium bicarbonate where the positive impact on performance has been confirmed. This presentation, brought to you by Talking Sports Science, will be a summary of their information. Firstly, how does sodium bicarbonate work? From a physiological perspective, during intense exercise, the hydrogen ion content in the blood and muscles increases. This increases muscle acidity, which lowers the pH, which contributes to fatigue, and therefore performance decreases. Sodium bicarbonate acts as an extracellular buffer. This helps to stabilise pH level during exercise and helps to delay fatigue. Supplementing with sodium bicarbonate therefore can delay fatigue and help to sustain high intensity exercise for longer. In terms of performance, a mean performance benefit of 2% has been reported for short term high intensity sprints lasting approximately 60 seconds. The performance benefit is reduced if the effort duration exceeds 10 minutes. However, greater performance benefit, for example, more than 8%, may be experienced if a greater number of repeated sprints are completed. Moving on to how much sodium bicarbonate to actually take. A single dose of 0.2 to 0.4 grams per kilogram of body mass consumed 60 to 150 minutes prior to exercise is recommended. However, this single dose can be split into several smaller doses taken over the course of 30 to 60 minutes. Or you can serially load up with sodium bicarbonate by ingesting 3 to 4 smaller doses per day for two to four consecutive days prior to an event. However, a common side effect of ingesting a single dose of sodium bicarbonate is you might experience gastrointestinal upset, which may negate any performance enhancement. Therefore, strategies to minimize gastrointestinal upset include taking sodium bicarbonate with a small carbohydrate rich meal which contains approximately 1.5 grams per kilogram of body mass of carbohydrates or you could use a split dose or serial loading protocols as previously mentioned or thirdly you could use sodium citrate as an alternative as less GI upsets have been reported Therefore, if you are considering taking sodium bicarbonate, like with all other supplements, it is recommended to first trial it during training to see how you get on before using prior to competition. And that concludes the presentation and this series on established performance supplements. If you're enjoying the content, check out some of the other videos on this channel. Thanks for listening folks, see you next time.